let's move on to the other group of colors which uh, clearly is a different pattern and it's a unique pattern they fall into so if we look up there um, here so we've got uh, for white abhyadu aswadu for black ahmaru for red akhtaru for green azraku for blue and so on and these are for muzakkar wahid noun so muzakkar wahid noun will be pronunciation like this azraku akhtaru ahmaru so if we want to say white which is feminine and the feminine words are which is singular feminine baida'u for black sauda'u and for red hamra'u for green khadra'u for blue zarka'u for yellow safra'u so wahid muzakkar and we have got wahid mu'annasir and then plural of these whether it's um, muzakkar or mu'annas the plural is the same word so for white we have a baidun for black sudun red humrun green khudrun blue zarkun so if we focus on these words uh, pay our attention and look carefully we will see they fall into certain patterns we are familiar with the um, roots and patterns in Arabic now we have discussed that in one of the previous videos so this um, Wahid Muzakkar goes with the pattern of Af'alu Af'alu so the all really Af'alu Abyadu, Aswadu, Ahmaru, Akhdaru, Asfaru, Azraku and Wahid Mu'annas follow the pattern of Fa'ala'u which is um, all of these colors Baida'u, Sauda'u, Hamra'u, Safra'u, Zarka'u, Khadra'u, etc. etc. And Jama of these, plural of both these, that falls the, in the pattern of Fo'lun. Fo'lun. So they follow these patterns. Af'alu for muzakkar and fa'alau for mu'annas and whether it's muzakkar or mu'annas plural of both is on the pattern of fo'lun let us look at uh, certain examples for example if we want to say a yellow car so yellow car so car is sayyaratun And ta marbuta means it is feminine. So sayyaratun. What kind of car? Yellow car. In Arabic, masuf comes first and then sifa follows. We know that. So sayyaratun because it's feminine and we want to say yellow car, we'll have to pick from here not asfaru but safra'u. So sayyaratun safra'u. A yellow car if we want to say a yellow house so house is baitun baitun and baitun is muzakkar so we are gonna pick this word from here asfaru so baitun asfaru also make a note that um, Baitun is um, with the tanween here, which means it's munsrif, and asfaru is a garu munsrif, so it is it takes only one dhamma. So baitun asfaru, both are marfu. So baitun asfaru, a yellow house. What if we want to say a yellow cow? 
So ko is a bakaraton. Bakaraton and yellow. So because ko is feminine, so we'll have to pick safra from here. So bakaraton safra u a yellow ko. And let us look at that example from Quran when um, Prophet Moses asked uh, his people to sacrifice a cow that Allah has commanded them to sacrifice a cow. And then um, because cow was sacred to them, so they started asking different questions and basically started digging out for themselves really and ended up in trouble. Um, so one of their questions was that Kalut ulana rabbaka yubayyillana ma'alonuha so for us ask your rab to clarify to us the color of the cow and um, kala so prophet moses said let's write that down kala he said prophet moses said kala innahu yakulu innahu Yakulu, he says, which means Allah says, Innahu Yakulu, Innaha, Innaha Bakaratun, Innaha Bakaratun Safra, Allah says, he says, which means Allah says, Innaha Bakaratun Safra, the said ko is of yellow color. Not only that, the next words are Bakaratun Safra u Fake Ullonuha. Fake un Lonuha. Fake un means a kind of um, deep or rich color. And Lonuha, Lonun is color and ha is the me which goes back to the cow and with, this is mudaf and mudaf like construction that's why the tamin of the loan has gone so fake loan ha her color is kind of really um deep and rich yellow color so the kind of cow which they really loved so they were asked to slaughter that cow if they have done right at the beginning they could have done they could have sacrificed any cow and the next was that Tasurun Nazarene. Tasurun Nazarene. Tasurun Nazarene. So basically, pleasing to the eyes uh, looks nice to those who look at it, um, which basically means pleasing to the eyes. So it's, it's a really deep yellow color which is pleasing to the eyes and they were asked to sacrifice that and they did it but they didn't really want to do it so they they had to do that okay so we have got these three patterns then um afalu fa'alau and fu'lun and uh, on these um, pattern afalu fa'alau um, we also get words which are not quite uh, color adjectives. For example, um, I have highlighted these two. Um, ashkaru in Arabic is um, light comple complected, which is blonde, fair color. And asmaru is dark complected or um, almond color. So. Asmaru and Ashkaru, these are basically more to do with facial appearance or your demeanor rather than really the colors. But they fall on the same pattern. So Muzakkar will be on the pattern of Af'alu. For example, we say Asmaru, dark complected man, and Samra'u dark complected woman which is fa'alau and if there are many men or many women with the same facial appearance we will say sumran on the pattern of fa'alun 